Hey guys, welcome back. This is Tarun again, back with another fitness video. So you've been asking me in many questions around uh, range of motion and uh, how do we feel the weight right, the technique, the right technique about weight training and stuff. Good question. I'm not saying these questions are bad. But I'm going to share something with you which probably, I'm pretty sure probably no one has ever shared this with you especially on uh, a social media platform like like YouTube or, or any other channel for that matter so I'm going to answer that question what should be the right technique for weight training but a little differently because I feel that uh, most of us most of us actually especially men understand the language of sex really well so I'm going to answer this question in that same manner so that you understand it and you are never confused about it ever again so let me share my example with you and this is something that I learned it over the back way back and you know I think it has it, it's still serving me good so here's a story so I was just like you you know confused about the range of motion and you know I was always confused how do I lift weights the right way I would go up to everybody and ask them Ki bhai mujhe bata de, wo how should I lift it uh, what is the right technique and stuff and everybody had their own say just exactly like we have today like on YouTube everybody is trying to tell you we should do it this 90 degree hand 90 degree angle 120 degree this you know you should do it like that they're demonstrating stuff for you and stuff like that and it all leading to confusion this is exactly what I was going through but there was no YouTube back then there were a lot of pseudo trainers trying to misguide me or, or giving me their own input which could have been true or not I don't know not, not that I care anyways so I came across this guy so uh, I went up to him and asked him I said uh, sir please just let me know I'm confused about this uh, uh, weight training uh, form I really don't understand how do I lift weights am I lifting the right way can you please tell me he looked at me said I will tell you one just remember that carefully and after that your form will be fine I said what he said to me guys listen to me very very carefully it may help you it helped me he said to me that you know Tarun weight training is just like sex and I was like really sex and I must be in my 18 19 year old guy and you know when you talk about sex to an 18 19 year old guy you know you suddenly have his attention right I was like sex what really tell me tell me tell me about it he said um, weight training is exactly like sex I said but yes tell me give me an example how is it how how they both are related I really want to understand this he said if you were to have sex, would you would you read a manual? Kya aap manual padoge sex karne se pehle? I was like, no, we would not. He said, if you would want to have sex or if you were to get married or anything, if you want to get intimate with a woman, would you ask people about it? Chances are you will not. You will only probably read up about it. And you know that too more of a reference point, but you will do it things your way. I was like, yeah, probably. I said, exactly. That is how weight training you can relate to sex. What it means is, there is definitely a right way to go about it. What is that right way? The right way is wherever you feel good, wherever you feel that stretch, wherever you feel that pump, it means you're doing it right. If, for example, if you're doing bench press, if you're feeling it in your, on your chest and if you're feeling the, really the stretch really hard and the pump, you're doing it right. Whether you're doing full range of motion or whether you're doing partial range of motion, that is obviously, you can obviously change as you progress, as you evolve in your weight training journey. So long you're feeling it, it's not like any when you're working on your bench press and you're feeling on your thighs, then there's a problem, your mind is somewhere else. So he said, do you feel when you do bench press or do you feel when you do shoulder press, do you feel it on your shoulder? I said, yeah. He said, when you have sex, do you feel good? Do you feel, I mean, do you like having sex? I said, who doesn't like having sex? He said, you don't read manuals before having sex? I said, no. He said, yeah, I do 
you know, happened to see some pawn, you know, which is more of a reference point. But he said, pawn, I would relate pawn to today's YouTube. So you would go to YouTube and watch shit load of channels telling you what to do, how to do this form right, that form right. But do you actually follow that? Maybe, maybe not. Similarly, you watch pawn, you do stuff, you see stuff, but do you actually do it uh, in real life? You know, when it comes to pleasing a woman or when it comes to pleasing your man, maybe, maybe not. So guys, the idea is not to get uh, uh, carried away with this whole emotion of sex. The idea that I'm trying to get across, I'm trying to get across to you folks is that there is no right or wrong. There is definitely a right range of motion. There is definitely a right technique to do things. Which obviously once you hit the gym, somebody will tell you or you will learn on your own. But don't waste your time or anyone else's time in understanding how do I go about it or you know, don't waste your precious time. Once you start doing it, you will get it right. You know, and, and chances are you will see YouTube, you will do a lot of stuff. And as you move along in your journey, you will learn all these techniques. So. Why do you waste this time and, and you know probably you know get carried away with these things? So remember, every time you want to master your technique, connect weightlifting or weight training with sex. It's as simple as that. You know, it's a very abstract thought. It's a thought that uh, uh, not too many people would actually you know think about something similar. I'm going to summarize it for you just in case you're wondering what's going on you really don't need to ask people about the technique because online you can only learn this much that much that's it once you hit the gym you learn on its own you know as you move along you will learn similarly like you go approach a woman or a man to have sex or get intimate with you don't ask people hey tell me how do i do this how do i do that no as you uh, get older in a relationship as you get to know that person really well you find your own ways to please that partner of yours. You really don't, you know, ask people about thing. How do I do it? What do I do? Yeah, you would want to read about it online. You would want to read some books and stuff so that you get some perspective. But that's about it. Right? That's my only point. So stop doing all this stuff and start focusing on the real deal, which is weight training. Seriously. And guys, and also, you know, I get this question a lot from people uh, uh, is uh, now that we're talking about sex. This question, I, that Tarun, will sex affect my gains in the gym? And I'm so fed up with this question. And I want to answer it once and for all. Though I've done a separate video for it, I'm just going to take about a few seconds and I'm going to answer this. I'm just going to, you know, probably tame this elephant right there and there, right here. You know, whosoever is telling you that, you know, you can't have sex, you know, when you're weight training and stuff. I think it's a piece of crap. You can guys, you know, what is what is fitness? Fitness is about you feeling good and sex is one emotion which makes us feel good. So if you're depriving of yourself of that one beautiful emotion, how is that going to make you feel good or make you feel any better? Simple, no, use your own fucking head man, use your own logic. It's as simple. Don't fucking complicate things, man. That, oh, I need to pack on muscle. You know, I want my testosterone level to be high. And, you know, if I were to masturbate or have sex, my testosterone will drop. It will affect my gains in the gym. You really think about all these things, man? Really? Come on, yeah. Get a fucking life, man. Want to have sex? Go have sex. Want to masturbate? Go masturbate, man. And, you know, they always remember fitness. And aesthetics is just one part of it, but fitness is and will always be about you feeling fucking good. Please always remember that. So I'm going to answer your question again. You can have sex. You can master it. So what you're trying to, so if, if, if you were to go by those so-called fitness experts, you're not going to have sex if you want to have gains in the gym. For how long? I thought you want to be working out for the rest of your life. So you're not going to have sex for the rest of your life? Do you? You sure? Think about it guys, come on, yeah. let's be very practical about things, yeah. please do what you want to do, do what makes you happy and fitness is all about making you happy. So I hope you get my answer here too. So anyone of you who have any questions around this, feel free to reach out to me on my YouTube channel. You know, anyone of you who have any questions around all these crazy topics, you can also write to me on my WhatsApp and you can also write to me on my Facebook channel. I'll be very happy to address all these queries. So till we meet again, see you.